Hey, how you guys doing? Welcome back to another video. Um, today is gonna be how to make uh, round corners with uh, on your farm. So you know, uh, right now you see this farm. It's not. It doesn't have any round corners. It won't show in a visual studio, but when you open it, you just have this. So uh, I'm gonna show you guys how to do it right now. So it's uh, super simple. It's really easy doesn't need too much stuff uh, so I'm gonna explain it so uh, I'm gonna put the code down below and uh, I'm gonna explain what the code is so basically if you want to add a custom theme to a form or uh, you know if you want to add a custom theme to the form you need a DLL file it's called DLL file and what we're gonna do is we're gonna import a DLL file and make an entry point uh, and it's gonna be the uh, react entry point when the form starts up and we're gonna tell it of which size or where it's going to uh, uh, so yeah let's get into it so as I said you're gonna go in the code here and you're gonna need uh, to um, use uh, this system it's called system runtime dot interop and in oh my god I can't talk cut that <laughs> so you're gonna need this uh, this one right here uh, the runtime interop services uh, so use that I mean when you enter the code and you uh, try to find a quick fix uh, or you click on the quick fix like this light bulb right here for the quick actions you'll see it but yeah let's get into writing the code so as I said before uh, we're gonna make a uh, DLL import and we're gonna make it that it's gonna create a DLL file I'm gonna call that file um, we're gonna call it what should we call it I'm gonna call it uh, let's call it okay we're just gonna call it the default one so GDI 32.dll and we're gonna now uh, add the entry point and we're gonna you can call your entry point whatever so we're gonna call it um, let's see what should we call it we're gonna call it round round corners there we go R G N. and uh, and now you're just gonna add the uh, where the corners are so uh, just to speed this process up and you'll see when I have everything typed in I'll put the code down below so let's do it
Okay, so that is uh, that, that is basically the code uh, for the first part, and now uh, now we basically made the file, and when it starts up, and we called it what we want to, but now we want it to apply. So what we're gonna do? Uh, we're gonna type right here in the public main form. We're gonna type this code, and it's gonna be. Uh, it's gonna be how round we want our um, our corners to be. So we're gonna make the four border style basically. So let's do it. And that is it. That's the code for uh, this. So now we're going to go back to the main form and we start up the program. We start the form. Well, it's going to take longer than normal to. Oh, we have a problem. System entry point not found except on the grid. Find more points in DLL. Okay, we need to fix that. So it does have to be a uh, certain name. Uh, so you can't call it actually what you want. So it does have to be a certain name. The original name for it is gonna be uh, create round uh, R E C T R G N. So we're gonna do that right now. So what we're gonna do? Actually, we're gonna close it and let's see if we can. Let's do that and highlight this. R. Okay. I'm just gonna do that, and then we're gonna call it create round R E C T R G N, and it's gonna be for the same here. Create round R E C T R G N. Round R E C T R G N. There we go. And now it should work <laughs> because now we have the original file name or the original entry point. Uh, if you have, if you want to change the name, you gotta i32.dll and change the uh, entry point name. So okay, so you got a, you got round corners. Nice. Uh, let's say you want it to be even more round you just change this it's right here these two and it will be more round so let's do it like 50 so you guys can see uh, you can notice the difference and look watch this so if you're gonna go 50 it's gonna eat through this button so what we need is just move it to the left a little bit and then start it now it's even more round than before original round corners and you can see right here if you do not move it and it's on the edge it would eat through the button and then you won't see the button anymore um, you might be like just bring it down a little bit and like put it here so it looks nicer but uh, yeah in my opinion this is too round I don't like it but you know everyone has his own opinion so uh, yeah hope you guys enjoyed it uh, leave a like if you did, 
um, I hope you guys appreciate that not a lot of people show this type of code or you know their secrets but I don't give two fucks I just do it you know so uh, yeah if you if you guys you know can you do me a favor just like and subscribe I'll catch you guys in the next one